help me take over from because I'm trying to handle a lot of things at once. So I was going to post it, but if you could help out with that. All right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. So um the meet need of the meeting is on the chat section. Hi, it's Thursday. Twenty-fifth of July. This is Chaos Africa meeting. Hi everyone, you're welcome. And today's meeting we already have. I'm going to be sharing my screen so that we'll have a look at the minutes. Yes. Yes. You're welcome to Chaos Africa's meeting. Just like every other Chaos meeting. If you are new to this meeting, you're you're welcome. Like Ruth was mentioning, we just seen someone for the first time and I mentioned their name. So you're welcome. And if you like, you can share your camera. If you if you don't want, that's still okay. That's still okay. So I also encourage you to look at uh Kios Code of Conduct to get to know more about Kios. Mm -hmm to understand how things have been done in Kios. Uh, so thank you everyone for joining. And today, I can see that some names, check the chat for just joining. I dropped the, the meeting doc on the chat so you can fill in your name. And our agenda today, we started by welcoming new persons, like I said, Kennedy, like, did I hear where is today your first, is this your first time? Uh, me? No. Oh. Yeah. I'm seeing that name for the first time. Okay, do okay. we have... <laughs> okay, do we have anybody, new person joining us? You are new to Chaos Meeting or Chaos Entirely? Or maybe this is your first time for joining Chaos Meeting, so want to say welcome. Anybody like that? Can unmute mute and speak up? You can just raise a hand if you don't want to speak. Yeah. So, hi. Um, this okay. Yeah. okay. So, okay. Hi. I had someone say hi. Um. Okay. Someone was speaking. Just say. Like... Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, my name is Tio, and this is my first time. I'm new to chaos and everything. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Good to have you. You're highly yeah. welcome. We're happy you are here. Okay, um, let me call on someone, Gloria Cree, please help me take minutes and then write out those names that are just joining us for the first time. Okay, yes, thank you so much for joining us. We are glad you're here with us. And someone else that I had some other name. Someone was okay. saying something. Good afternoon. Yeah. Good afternoon. Um, not, I think it's my first time doing the meeting, though. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Good to have you. You're welcome. Okay. Do we have any other person? You're joining for the first time? Just feel free to introduce yourself. Okay, thank you. And today is an agenda, just as I'm looking at it. Um, newcomers, just feel free to get to um, check the Kiosk Code of Conduct to know everything, like I said earlier, about Kiosk. And also watch out the general channels. That's where a whole lot of things happen in Kiosk are being posted. And join Kiosk Africa channels. There are different working groups where you can get to understand what is going on and then know exactly where to fit in. Again, you can also join Kios weekly meeting to understand what's going on and also the project that you might want to work on. Yeah. Also, feel free to ask questions, right? So you can understand. Someone will explain to you if you don't know anything at all here at Kios. We carry, try to carry everybody along. If you're a designer, depends on your skill set. 
there's a place for you here. Okay, so that that and thank you everybody. The next thing in our agenda is uh videos for facilitators for Chaos Africa. Yes. Here we're talking about those if you're interested to facilitate Chaos Africa meeting, you can put in your name so that we know. Yes, my dear. All right. Thank you, Ramat, for muting. Uh, okay, so as I was saying, if you're interested in um, facilitating Kios Africa meeting, you feel free to like under this second agenda, you can drop your name that you're interested in facilitating Kios Africa meeting anytime, any day. It's roots are can decide on that to assign to you or call on you to go ahead or give you a time or a date to facilitate Kios Africa meeting. So um, that's that. The next thing we're going to look at is update from the focus group. So now I'm going to be looking at different focus group we have. We have design group, we have uh, research, we have group, and we have accessibility and disability and accessibility group. Then we have project management group and which other group, if I didn't call your own group, please uh, remind me or drop it on the chat. I will look at that and measure your group. Okay, so um, feel free to add agenda two if you there's anything specific thing you want us to talk about in the agenda you can also drop it so that we can get to talk about it or give you opportunity for you to talk about that so now i'm going to be calling on the design team let's get some updates from you what has been happening new things and what is going on now yes i think uh kisley is here so kisley over to you Yes, Kinsley. Hi, everyone. Hi. Hi, Peculia. Thank you so Hi. much. Yeah. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you perfectly well. Okay, yeah. So um um I think I will just go on um the Okay, so the last call I had, uh, I'm going to start with um, our first project. So the last call, I I had a call, I think about two weeks ago with um, Desmond, if I'm correct, I think that's his name. So I had a call with Desmond and um, we concluded on um, the pathway um, to implement um, our first project. And um, based on our discussion, I think that much of the work now really lies with the front end guys, um, because um, for the design, which our, our primary responsibility was kind of like working on a simple landing page to Spotlight African Open Source Project, so we have that sorted out, right? And um, where we had a little delay was maybe whether or not to use the dashboard. But then my conversation with um I think I also had other members of the design working group on that course. So my discussion with Desmond was um that when you click on um summit projects on the Apple's landing page, which I've shared a couple of times on this call. So when you click on um Summit projects, and um, so you create a form, basically just fill a form rather, right? Which is also one of the things um, that has been handled by Belema, the form part. So when you fill the form, right, and um, it's just gonna create some um, a PR, right, and GitHub, and then when that's being reviewed and merged. 
um, that project will be displayed on um, our first landing page. So taking away the need to probably create a maybe an admin dashboard and posting it separately, right? Which is also gonna probably cost a, a lot more to maintain. So that's for our first project for um Ogo. Um, there have been some changes, right, you know, from the board last time. Okay, so I'm going to put a file. Give me a moment. Let me see if I can pull that up. Um, on me, Dave, on the call, if you can help me drop that. So, yeah, yeah, so for... Um, over project, right? Uh, which Lamy has really been the main person involved and Emmanuel. So I know there've been, to the best of my knowledge, there've been some changes, right? After the initial designs been done, uh, there've been some, I think, other modif uh, modification and all that uh, from the core team. So, Lami and I probably she has actually gone ahead to fix some of those, but we're also still discussing about that. Anyways, I think the old challenge was just around like because what we have, the design we have right now, it's just a complete overhaul of the initial um the live platform, right? We've checked all the website. So what we have now very different from that. So um I think the comments was really about thank you, Midi. So the comment was about just uh, not having a complete overhaul or rather something that is also uh, something that wouldn't take so much time to implement, right? So the conversation was just really around that. And, uh, hopefully, I think we'll just get past that, but work is still ongoing on that regard. Um, sadly, I think something happened <laughs> that um, we actually... Um, uh, skipped a meeting, I think last week, because the timing for the last meeting uh, was wrong and all that. So I haven't been able to, you know, sync with a few other persons that are working on one or two things to get their feedback anyways. But I also know that um, Mide and um, um, Felix were also working on just ensuring that the styles that we, we have on of course projects correspond with all the screens that has been designed already because I think there are actually some you know changes because we had different persons working on um, the project and I noticed maybe some of them didn't take note of the style guide that was created. So um Mide and Felix, yeah, just fixing that up. So yeah, I think that's just about what we have ongoing. Then um, Elizabeth actually had this request. Um, Belema reached out that she's done with it, adding, um, a, I think, a, a few stuff to the timeline we have on the Chaos website. So uh, Belema reached out that like, that task was assigned to Belema. So she's done with that task. And um, I think the only thing still pending, I'm just really optimistic that by the end of this year, <laughs> we'll be able to just clear that out, right? It's, um, I really look forward to having a, a solid um, brand, you know, um, brand assets, right? Um, designs, really, I'm, I'm coming, trying to check. We have another design to discuss. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Catherine, I think we can discuss that. We can agree on a time that works. Be glad to do that. So lastly, I think um, yeah, I was just talking about the chaos brand style guide. So it's just something that is in progress, and I'm just um getting a couple of other persons to join me, right? To pull it off. So that's my feedback. Thank you so much. Um thank you, yeah. Over to you, please. I don't know if you have questions. You can ask specific questions. Thank you. Thank you so much for that. That's really uh, a whole lot that design team you're doing. 
then my question is that, um, like, do you, if you assign a tax or someone is working on something, do you have like timeline for it? Or you wait for them until they're done, they let you know that they're done. I'm just curious about that. Okay, so it depends on, like, say, actually, uh, you know, it's open source, right? It's a marathon, yeah. not a sprint. So it, it depends on what is being worked on, right? So the first question, if the task is coming from the core team, right? Uh, one of the first questions I usually ask, you know, it, um, is it an urgent task or something, right? So, well, luckily, we've also had people, for example, the uh, stuff, the uh, the design Elizabeth requested for where this person worked on. I think she, uh, luckily she was actually the one, Belema was, I think one of the designers that worked on the chaos website. So I think she still had access to some of the stuff she worked on. Um, so she was able to pull that up. So yes and no, sometimes if the tax is urgent, depending on who is, you know, bringing up the tax, then we can assign a timeline to it. But if it's not, probably just leave it to the contributor to, you know, fix it up when he or she is, you know, comfortable enough to fix that up, yeah. Okay, that's amazing. Okay, yes, we well done for that. So um, everybody in the house, do you have anything, any question you want to say or want to ask Kinsley or any about design, design team? Please, if you have, okay, yes. Andy, so Captain, please go ahead. Yes. Hi, Peculia. Hi, Kinkley. Hi, Isabel. Hi. If you're doing great. Oh, you are. Um, Kinkley, I have a question for the Figma file that's been shared. What is ready? It, it, uh, I've seen these, the old designs, and then these, what is ready for implementation. Um, the designs that are in the ready for implementation page is what we'll be working on. Um, yes, yeah. So um, um, I think another thing I will, uh, Mide, please just help me do that too. Um, you just help me push like maybe a few other additional stuff we have to that page, you know, because we have a couple of other pages where we had different people working yeah. on different screens. So we just help you, you know, push everything to just basically just clean up the file so that you know what to focus on, right? Maybe when we have our okay. call, we also discuss that. Thank you, Catherine. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think that would be helpful because what I'm seeing on the ready for implementation um, is what we had implemented. It's what's on the current website. And then I had you mentioned that maybe there's going to be a form and I'm seeing also some, uh, there's going to be an admin dashboard, um, so yeah i think that's what i was trying to figure out um i think i'll just dm you i'll, I'll send you a message on slack and then we can plan when to have our meeting but thank you for for keeping up with it yeah yeah thank you you're welcome <laughs> so don't really bother so much about the admin so that's what we are okay. we are not working on that anymore yeah oh okay all right, I'll talk to you on Slack then. Yeah, thank you so much, Captain. Thank you so much, Kinsley. Any other person, do you have question for Kinsley or you actually have something you want to contribute, add to, that will help that to do something? Okay. Thank you so much. So we move over to the next, that's accessibility team. We need feedback, progress, success, any blocker at all from the accessibility. Please, um, is Yiga here or Victoria, any of them, or someone in that team, project manager, I want Hello. to keep us. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Cecilia. Hello, everyone. Um, 
feedback so far. We had our last meeting on Monday. Uh, even Kekilia was present. <laughs> Kekilia, Winifred, and myself. Brian was not available. His schedule was on transit. And we didn't really have much attendees as well. So before I actually start the feedback for uh, what we've been doing so far, I also want to talk about our meetings. We already spoke to Elizabeth to add the meeting schedule to the calendar. I think that's still pending. But we do have our meetings on Mondays by 6 p.m. So it's now by weekly. So the next time we'll be meeting is not this Monday, it's next Monday. Right, so we have biweekly meetings on Monday by 6 p.m. Please join us. Let's talk about how to make open source accessible. So feedback about what we've been doing so far. Um, we still are waiting on feedback from the project enabled team on the concluded events. So we filled some forms before during the event, but Lanmi created a new form for the research team. She created a new form for feedback on how the event went. And we also want the um, community members to join us in the testing process to um, test our website and other our website and other projects in chaos to um to get their own POV as it concerns usability and accessibility. So we are still waiting on feedback from Michael and the rest of the team in Project Enable. That's it for the research. I know um, Lamy sent me a message earlier. Uh, I just thought that I was waiting for feedback. I reached out to them this week. So uh, hopefully after this meeting, maybe tomorrow, I'll follow up on the um I'll follow up, follow up on them. Then um we had a few things on our agenda to do. Um, one of them is a goal, a six months to go between the next end of the year for things we'd want to achieve. And I think Winifred, one of the things Winifred suggested was, um, oof, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm fitting. One of the things suggested is uh, more collaborations with other communities that cater for people with disability and introducing them to and tech, right? And introducing them to open source. So that's part of our goal for the year and before the year ends. We also have some mm -hmm. action items, like we suggested a workshop, mm -hmm. right? For people in chaos who are contributing to open source mm -hmm. and how to implement accessibility in in working groups, right? We already spoke to Elizabeth about it during the, I think the the last community call. And we talked about organizing a workshop. And we also talked about the auditing that is being carried out. And the reason is currently on pause. Some of the audits um, done have not been implemented just yet, right? So um, Elizabeth and every other person on the on her team said the reason that is because it's a CMS, um, they using a CMS that's WordPress. So they still need to like figure out how to implement it on WordPress, which is one of the reasons we are pushing for the workshop as well, so that can help us to integrate whatever changes that are being made on a lot of all these rather have been made on the project so far. Um, we also talked about how to involve other African countries in the disability and inclusion working group. Uh, we know that there are some African countries like Uganda, uh, Kenya, Angola, who we even joined the last October first, so we're looking for ways to also include them in the disability inclusion um, activities. How to also look for a way to bring in members of their communities to implement accessibility here. Yeah. So I think that is it so far for our updates. I think there's only one thing I'm missing. Yeah, thank you, Victoria. 
that's awesome. You, your team, you're doing a great job. Um, I have a question here. What you say, talk about project enables feedback. Have you like your team send a mail to them requesting for what you needed from them? And what's the feedback like? Are they willing to give or that withholding such information? Oh no, I don't think the issue is withholding information, right? They are pretty slow with following up on their emails. So I follow them up on their WhatsApp as well. So while we send emails, I'm also in their um, DMs trying to follow up and testing it up, right? So I text after we send official emails to their yeah to their emails. We I send Mike or Allen or any other person on the team a DM like, okay, we are requesting for this. Can you check your DM or can you give us feedback, right? So they're not withholding information. I guess everyone is busy. So sometimes they miss the emails, right? Sometimes they miss it. So if, I think currently Mike actually thought we had sent the form before because he was like, the form you're requesting feedback from was not the same form you sent during the event. And I'm saying, okay, no, that's a different one. I think that is what it was stored that particular feedback, right? So I'm going to, he, he, I just reminded him that it's not the same form. So he still has to share it with the that community and give us feedback. So okay. hopefully either tomorrow or Monday, I should get complete feedback on that. Oh yeah, I forgot something. Um, The blog post for, there's also feedback on the blog post for okay. the event. So the, an uh, action item is to create a repository for, and we need people who actually attended events. So we're, we're hoping that people who attended can um, look to contribute so that we can complete the details of the blog post. I'm talking about the one that Ruth shared in the, in the chaos group yeah, about the events and how everything went. So if people who attended the event are willing to put in their two cents, we would really appreciate it, but we will want to create a report for that so that they can just comment and be assigned to it. Okay, that's good. Um, for the blog post, right, I'm thinking if it's an issue instead of repo, because a repo is going to be like accessibility, um, has a, has a repo, so creating an issue on that repo, I'm thinking that might help. What do you think? Yeah, um, um, you guys really help with things like this, so I can just reach out to her to see if you can create an issue on that the already existing okay. repo. Great, great, well done. Okay, and if, do do we have any question, anything at all? for this focus group? Anybody, any questions? I'm not seeing any hand. Okay. If there is one, so move over to the next focus group. Um, the next one is project managers. Yes, project managers, who is here to take that off? We need feedback from your end, Busayo, Iga, is there any of you here? Okay, can see Sayo or I think I'm going to take that. This I'm talking about project management, so I'm calling the pushes. Yeah. Okay. Um, so also in the project manager focus group. Um but we're just calling the coaches so they can okay. give us a feedback. So I would, I think I would take that. Off. Okay, so basically we just started. We've had a full first meeting like the last two weeks and then we had one. Yes, that was a Tuesday and um, we are still trying to adjust a lot of things and get this project management team moving very well. All we were able to do is to um, 
try to reschedule a lot of things and assign projects to those that doesn't have projects already they're managing. Then there were some people that took on a project some time ago. And I'm trying to, we're trying to get their feedback if they're interested or if they, they're still interested in, in uh, being a project manager for that, those uh, project or if they have some other things that are doing so we can assign the project to new uh, project managers. So last week, we this week, let me say this week, we looked at that also, and then we looked at how to create um, project board that's GitHub project board for which project managers use for project management. So um, that's all we've been doing, we've done for now. So hopefully for our next project management meeting, we are going to do more than this by trying to find out, we plan to find out, start getting information from project managers on the project they're managing, feedback, how the project is going and all that they need hand to do, all they need to do wherever they need help in each project they're managing, yes. Um, my hand is up, yes, IJ. Yes, question here, IJ, yes, go ahead. Your hand is up. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay, um, it's it's been a while I came to meeting, so I really didn't know when the project manager um, group was formed, so I just wanted to okay. know what it's about more. And um, what is it for? What do they do? How do you get involved like that? Okay. So for project managers who want to get involved, we have a channel on the uh, Chaos Africa. That's WG Project Managers channel. You can join there. So all the information has been shared there. And the meetings happen 6 p.m. what? On Tuesdays. So uh, you're free to join that meeting so you can get more information on that. Have I answered the question? Yes. yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Any other thing, any other question? Uh, okay, I think what they do, what they actually do is to manage your projects. You're being assigned to different projects and you manage, create tasks, assign and know what's going on in the project and ensure that the project is actually uh, progressing and that's most of the things that's been doing. Thank you so much. And then the next one is a uh, technical writers and I see Harmony there. Yes, Harmony, are you able to give us feedback here? Yes, technical writers. Hello, can you guys hear me? Yes, Hello? we can hear you. Yes, okay, loud so, and clear. Yeah. So we had um the last meeting we had with the um with the developer sync, we had a core objective on certain things that we are going to take up as technical writers to focus on, which includes streamlining issues on badging websites, uh working on some regulatory documents to help uh contributors and also people that are submitting PRO. We, we just kick-started kick the technical writers focus group and we're trying to set things in place and get our priorities straight as well as get more people to contribute inwards. So our first sync meeting will be holding next week, Wednesday, 12 p.m. What? I'm also using this opportunity to call on other persons that might be interested in working together with the team. So far, after the meeting we have with the developers, we've been working closely with Adenka and Gloria, and we have been able to been able to do to fix some issues that the badging website was facing, which includes the the pagination uh, invert colors, uh, the table um, badging table. 
uh, table spaces to increase the um, and a couple of other issues. So I think by when we have the meeting, when we have the meeting by next week, we'll be able to work on more things that we took note of during the developer sync. Basically, that's that's it so far. Okay, so, but then we need you. more people, more hands in the technical writers group. Okay, thank you so much for that, Hamza. Please, if you are interested in working with in this team, technical writers at the focus group, please meet Harmony. He's doing out some work there. Okay, the next one is uh podcast, podcast recording. Um, I think that should be Harmony too. Yeah. Um, that there, right? Okay. Yes. Yeah. So, so far, I've been working closely with the um, Chaos Cast team, and we have a couple of stuff that are focused for Chaos Africa. We have a series that we're working on called 20 Minutes with Chaos Africa, where we get to have a section where contributors and community members come to talk about their experience in contributing and how open source can be better. So... We are currently looking for volunteers that will be willing to have a panel session with us. It's an audio-based um, podcast. You don't have to show your face, right? It's completely audio-based. So it's a medium. It's a series where we take feedbacks from community members and see how chaos can actually better off experience, your experience in contributing. So basically, so this is like a call if you're open to have like a one-on-one -on -one section with us or a panel where we discuss uh, things about Chaos Africa, where Chaos Cast is going to upload it. That's cool. Just That's to reach out. Please, if you're interested in doing this, just reach out. Or if you have any question for him, do you reach out. Okay, we also have in the Chaos uh, Slack channel there channel for technical writers so you can also join to know more about what is happening there so the next one oh let me check if there's anybody that you have question for harmony harmony is doing a whole lot of wonderful work is a technical team uh writers team and then podcast just cast uh, pod recording okay no question so so Let's look at the feedback from research focus group. Um, I think Lamy should hear. Um, feedback from there. Lamy, if you're here, please. If not, we'll move over to sustain summit. Um. Sorry, help me. Who are they sustain here, and who is who wants to talk about that? Sustain. Uh, is that you? Wait one. Okay, yes, Hamza, your hand is up, please. Please go ahead, Hamza. Okay, thank you. Uh, I don't know who. I'm not going to put it there, but. We have a little bit context about what sustain is. So sustain is uh, sustain for me happening tomorrow. It's uh, an annual sustainability around the process meeting that usually happen in Lagos. So uh, I love to root made the announcement on Slack channel that anybody that's interested should DM her his email or her email address so that she can invite him. I got my exclusive invite and I know some couple of members here who are all who also got uh, um, exclusive invite, so we are connecting there. We're having discussion around sustainability, so that's basically what the sustain meeting is all about. So, uh, can't wait to see any of you who will be who will be in attendance tomorrow. Thank you, thank you, Hansa. That's awesome. Thank you for that for taking that up. And if anybody do you have question, you want to be part of that meeting tomorrow, I think tomorrow, right? Am I right? Yes, tomorrow. Okay, thank you. If you have any mm -hmm. question how to get to the venue, how to get other information, please, and you're interested in going there, attending the meeting, please reach out to Ruth. 
on Slack so that you can, I think there's something she gives them so you can receive yours, okay? So um, as many of you that are going to be there tomorrow, please have fun and send us the pictures. Okay, so any other thing you want us to say, something happened in your focus group? Or there's a reminder you want us to know about, maybe a conference that we can apply for or other things that can help um, um, the Chaos Africa team. Please feel free to maybe raise a hand to share that. A new project you want people to work on, feel free to... Um, Speaker. Okay. Okay. I'm going through to see if there's another thing. Okay, yes. Please, Ayomide, go ahead. Thank you. Uh, hey, hello, everyone. Um, can you hear me clearly, please? Good day. Hello? Hello, we can hear you. Go ahead, please. Oh, thank you. Um, hello, everyone. My name is Amide. I am with the uh, product design team. I, I don't have anything to really add, uh, apart from the um, changes I'm going to make to the ready, ready to implementation page. For is this me or I can hear your media very well? Please, can any, can any other person hear you very well? Uh, can you hear me now? Much better. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I just wanted to say I, I don't have much to add. I just want to like give acknowledge the fact that um Kios has actually grown and we've actually had more groups because I remember early in early or mid last year we we're talking about adding product managers when we had like one or two. Now we have like a, a group, then we have another group of um technical writers and then the, uh, the podcast section which has also grown. So I just I just want to like make um make a shout out to everyone and um, really nice job, and I love the fact that Chaos is really great. Awesome. I admit it, that's really great. In fact, that's a great observation. Thank you so much for bringing that up. That's a great observation. Okay, so um, any other thing uh, you want to say? Someone has given shout out to Chaos Africa, and we're doing great. And it's so amazing seeing how we collaborate in uh, co collaborate in different projects and help others join and know what is happening in open source benefit from it. That's it's really amazing seeing that from Chaos Africa. Okay, I'm going to, to see any other thing. All right, thank you so so much for joining this meeting. If today is just your first time joining this meeting and we we didn't introduce yourself before we we'll wrap up, please feel free to introduce yourself. You can raise your hand so I can call you to introduce yourself. It's amazing like knowing that you are part of this community in case we see you tomorrow. Like I know tomorrow they're going to see a whole lot of chaos members in sustain. So it would be amazing to also know that you are here. You are new and you're welcome. All right. Apart from that, thank you so much, you everyone, you for are joining. Are you going to attend tomorrow's meeting? Oh, sorry. Somebody's hand is up. Ruth, what? go ahead. Okay. I'm new here. My name is Ruth Usara. Yes. Uh, so nice to be here. Oh, that's amazing, Ruth. You're welcome. So we're happy to have you. Thank you so much. Join Kios. And thank you. So those thank that you. are new, yeah, you're welcome. Those that are new, please don't forget every Tuesday to, to join the newcomers a meeting with Elizabeth so you can get to understand a whole lot of things happening in Kios and ask questions. And also ask questions on Slack. If you ask us, and I know that there are a whole lot of wonderful persons we have here in Kiosk, a, a wonderful people in, in Kiosk community that will answer your question. Then look out for projects to 
contribute to. If you don't, if you don't know anyone, you can just drop your skill set. Someone will actually guide you and direct you to a project that matches that. Okay. Welcome, Ruth and others. All right. So this is a wrap. So thank you for joining everybody today's meeting. See everybody again next two weeks. And thank you, Gloria, for helping us take notes. I really appreciate that. So bye, everybody. Um, check once more to show. Is yes, to be sure I pick everybody. So bye, everybody. Hi, Bakuya. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. I can hear you. Okay,